All right, welcome back everybody to JA from the Bay and Word of the Day. I'm so excited you could be here with us today. First of all, before we get started with the Word of the Day, we have a great one for you today. I just want to say uh, thank you so much for my one subscriber. We hit, we passed one subscriber, guys. Huge milestone for the channel. We're well on our way to 10 million subscribers by now. It's absolutely awesome. I just want to say I'm, I'm so blessed. Thank you, guys. Comment down below, my subscribers, you know, what you, what word you want to hear next, and we'll, and we'll do it there. If you think this is funny, go ahead and smash that like button and smash that subscribe. I'm just I'm just freaking kidding, man. But thank you for the one subscriber. Huge milestone. Let's, uh, with all due, let's get right into it. So, word of the day. The word of the day today is caddy wampus. Caddy wampus. Very good word. I use it all the time. I actually use it probably multiple times a day, almost every day, almost every busy meeting. So what is cattywampus? Cattywampus, the definition, are uh, is not lined up or not arranged correctly or diagonally. So like an example, cattywampus are um, things that positions like items on the coffee table, right? They've been they've been around. They're all they're all kind of uh, not in the right place. Or stuff that's like diagonal, right? So not in a straight line, kind of off, right? Right, you know, like uh, in San Diego, we have this place called uh, we have this place called Hillcrest. There, the men there are very cattywampus, right? They're not straight. So I say it all the time. Hey, you look you look like a cattywampus guy. I mean, you're, you're a little diagonal, eh? Yeah. Did they get it? No. Uh, or like every every single day, I walk into a business meeting. I, first thing I do, I sit down and see the executive, you know, the ha head honcho, the guy. Got to make a sale. First thing I say, I say, hey, sir, your tie? Your tie? I don't say it looks good. I say, sir, your tie is cattywampus. Fix it. I don't want to be looking at your cattywampus tie all day. Absolutely horrendous. Horrible. Right? Or sometimes maybe driving the car and the, and the, the wheels, they ain't right. You know? Need, need alignment. It's not aligned properly. Well, then your car is a little cattywampus. You can't be driving down the street in the lowrider with Jose and a cattywampus whip, baby. You gotta be straight. Gotta be straight as an arrow. Speaking of arrows, hanging out with Joe Rogan the other day. Me and him, we hang out all the time. We're shooting arrows. You know, he's a hunter. I don't really hunt, but we're shooting bone arrows. Shooting bone arrows, boom. Shooting. Bo I'm not shooting bow straight, man. I'm shooting a bow cattywampus. So that's the word of the day, guys. Cattywampus. Great word. Go out there and use it. Uh, I just gave you tons of examples on how to use it. Just go out there. And, uh, and and just in, instead of going straight today, go cattywampus. Take it, take your next turn, do a diagonal thing. You know, like the in, in China when they have the the cross streets. You know, everyone in, in America we we cross the streets straight, right? But in Japan, China they they cross the street cattywampus. It's ridiculous. I don't know how they I don't know how anything functions over there, right? Maybe that's why the pollution's so high. Who knows, right? Anyway, word of the day. Have a good one. Have a blessed day. Your boys out.